Hey there everybody, this is The Framed, and welcome back to the next episode of my Pokemon Emerald playthrough, where you all, my viewers, have chosen my team for me. So, in the last episode, we made our way to uh, Meteor Falls, where we found Team Aqua and Team Magma fighting over the Meteorite. And, uh, so we followed them here to Mount Chimney, where uh, Team Magma, I believe, is trying to... Or is it Team Aqua? Team Aqua is trying to do something, uh, devious with the... Uh, with the uh, meteorite, and we are here to stop them, of course. Uh, so we're gonna just kind of be on our way, and uh, as you can see, we got Team Aqua and Team Magma uh, locked in battle, epic battles. Uh, you can uh, you can talk to them, and I think they say douse douse him in fire, outnumber us. Darn, Team Magma, we can't keep up with them. Dun 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 dun. Team where team magma where there big magma. Anyways, so uh, we're gonna just go over here and we have a few trainer battles to, and to to do here and then I believe we have a boss battle type thing with team magma uh, uh, leader person. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna look who we have in our in our slots here and we have Shudinja in our second slot and I'm actually gonna switch him out because I'm guessing team magma might have some fire Pokemon. Just a guess. I don't know. Maybe that's just me. But anyways, we're going to switch to uh, Marsh Taunt because uh, he's the only other one that doesn't have a weakness to fire. So yeah. Uh, I'm not really... Uh, a lot of their Pokemon are going to be dark too. I think they have like Poochienas and stuff like that as well. Uh, but whatever. Like if uh, that thing's power made more land, uh, there'd be more places to live. Everyone to be happy. Uh, if there were more land to be able to get a big house of my own, uh, I'm going to build it on hardened lava. Okay, so one one of those people is looking out for other people, and the other one is super selfish. Haha. -ha. Interesting. Anyways, we got uh, two Pokemon here, one each, and we are just going to use Ember on that one and Water Gun on that one, and say goodbye, and not goodbye. And goodbye. Uh, easy peasy. Alright. So, we got another trainer battle here. And during this trainer battle, I will talk about uh, a comment that was left in the uh, previous episode. Uh, it was... Well, the comment was that I... I think this is what it was it said, at least. That I... Um, that I use a magic harp. Uh, for the time being, until I get, um, before I'm able to get a bag on, which will eventually turn into Salamence, which is the final member of my team. Uh, I, oh gosh, I can't remember, uh, the name of, uh, the guy that, uh, left the comment at the moment. I'll put it in, it, put it in the, uh, in the description, I think. But, um, but yeah, he suggested that I use a Magikarp, just for the funsies of it, I guess. And I'm kind of inclined to try it just because it sounds kind of hilarious. And I mean, no disrespect to uh, Maxwell the Camper who uh, actually came up with the team for this entire playthrough. Uh, but I mean, I, I'm not going to be able to get uh, the final Pokemon of my team until the end of the game anyways. So I think it would be kind of, kind of fun just to use Magikarp maybe for at least a little while. Uh, just because it's kind of silly. Uh, but... Uh, since I'm not really around water really much for a little while, uh, I probably will not obtain my Magikarp till uh, a few episodes from now. And chances are I will not uh, catch it on, on uh, or I'll record myself catching it. I'll talk about this more in a minute. Uh, I'm going to read this stuff. Uh, the power contained in the meteorite. Uh, by amplifying its power with the machine, Mount Chimney's volcanic activity will instantly intensify. Its energy will grow deep inside the, the uh, crater and... Foo-foo! <laughs> hmm, who are you? Uh, I'd, uh, I'd he heard Archie uh, be moaning? Be moaning? Is that a word? Be moaning. Anyways, uh, a child who's been meddling in Team Aqua's affairs. Uh, I must... Uh, it must uh, be you, he meant. Hmm. 
So you're thinking of interfering with us, Team Magma. Now you listen. Long ago, living things used uh, the land to live and grow. Uh, that is why the land is is all important. It is the cradle of all. Uh, what is, that is why Team Magma is dedicated to the expansion of the land mass. Uh, it is for further advancement of humankind and Pokemon. And for that, we need the power of what sleeps within this mountain. Oh, and there's no need for you to learn that much. Uh, but no matter. I'll teach you the consequences of meddling in our grand design. Uh, so this is Maxi. He's the Team Magma leader. And uh, I should be able to take him down pretty handily here. Um, but yeah, he's got a Mighty Anna. And I'm going to go back to what I was talking about earlier. Uh, I don't think I'm going to catch the Magikarp on camera because I don't want to take away from uh, actual gameplay. So uh, maybe next episode, ouch, or uh, the episode after that, uh, crap, a, uh, a Magikarp might just magically show up in my party, which is, you know, it's all right, you know. Um... Oh, I definitely should have switched out Pokemon. I suck. Well, I don't know what I'm going to do here. Uh huh. That shouldn't do that, that much damage. Wow, that was probably as hard as Pokemon. So that was kind of terrifying. Um, <laughs> uh, that could have gone pretty bad. Uh, shucks. How? Oh, right. Flying type attack. Duh. Um, should Ninja might get taken down here? And Super Potion, frick. Goodbye. And let's go Nummo! Ember, frick. Crap! Uh, well this is severely embarrassing. I was not paying attention, I was busy talking. Uh, and I accidentally had to use Linoon. Oh, I suck. Anyways. Uh, but don't think uh, that this is the last you've seen of Team Magma, Fufu. Uh, even without the meteorite, uh, if we obtain that orb, Fufu. Uh, framed, thank you. Uh, with your help, we thwarted Team Magma's destructive plan. But you, whose side are you on? Ah, it doesn't matter. Uh, we will remain vigilant and keep up our pursuit of Team Magma. Framed, we shall meet again. Um, so I like goofed up hardcore there, there during that battle. I was busy talking instead of paying attention to what I was doing. And uh, basically, I lost everybody except for Linoon, which is exactly what happened in the second gym battle against uh, Brawny or whatever his name is. Uh, so my Linoon got like all that experience, which is really dumb because I'm not even using Linoon in my party. He's just kind of there as my HM slave. But, oh well, that, that's life I guess. We're not going to worry about it. We're just going to make our way to the next town. Talk to this guy. What you got to say? Uh, uh, he's got a lava cookie. Okay. I'll take a lava cookie. I don't really know what it does. I think it restores health or maybe it re like does something with burn. I don't know. Um, we're going to try and avoid as many trainers as we can. Oh, this is a good place uh, to uh, demonstrate what happens with the acro bike. Uh, but... Anyways, as I was saying, uh, gonna try and avoid as many trainers as possible because I don't really want to give uh, Linoon all the experience. But anyways, see, now that we have uh, the acro bike, we can do this hoppy stuff, and we can hop, hop, hop down uh, stuff because normally uh, you just run into it, and we got a spoink, and we're gonna say go away, go away. See, we got, a sp you can't. I'm going, but you can't. So you press, uh, press. B and you just start hopping and he does something I don't know if I should talk to him right now but I'm going to what what are you doing here what am I doing in this place in a place like this what business is it is yours and he wants to battle me frick I was really hoping he just wanted to talk to me um, but I suck you know whatever not gonna worry about it and I pressed over for some reason so you secret power I should have used a uh, rock smash because it's a fighting type move. And we got Numile, and we're gonna use strength. And well, 
I mean, I feel kind of dumb that I'm using Line Noon, but... Anyways, don't worry. Interesting. Oh, we got an item. Items are fun, but my bag is too full. Frick! Um, so, uh, what we're going to do is when we get to the uh, Pokemon Center, we're going to put some items in the in the thing. And this guy wants to battle us. Frick! Uh, I apologize, everybody. I am just... I'm bad at this game. What can I say? I'm just... I'm just no good. Uh, it probably doesn't help that I'm somewhat underleveled. Uh, I should probably be uh, trying to level grind a little bit, and he wants my number. But uh, I'm lazy. What can I say? And we're going to go into the Pokemon Center here and heal up. And I think we're going to try and take on the gym battle here in uh, Lava Ridge Town. And for some reason, I want to do that twice. Oh, I forgot that we can go do something here. We're going to go behind here, and we talk to this guy, and he's got some magical springs, and we can talk to these people, and they're like, hey, look, we're in the springs. Uh, so yeah, you can go in the spring, and then you can go over here, and I th think you talk to one of these people. Oh, here's an egg. I, uh, I'd i hope to hatch it by covering it in hot sand by hot springs, but it doesn't seem to be enough. I further it would be best if it were kept together with Pokemon and carried about. You are a trainer, yes, and your Pokemon radiate violent. Say radiate violently? Is that what that said? I don't remember. Uh, but anyways, uh, so what do you say? Will you take this egg and to hatch it? Oh, of course I will. Oh, you've s oh you've so many Pokemon. Oh, I have no room for the egg. Gosh dang it. Okay. Um, so um, I'm actually not gonna get the egg because I won't do anything with it. But uh, for your own playthroughs, if you're playing along along with me. Uh, talk to this fella, or this girl actually, I guess that's a, that is a female. My, my bad. Talk to her. Look at me, I'm in the dirt. Uh, talk to her and you can get a egg and I believe it, uh, will hatch into a why not. I'm pretty sure about that. Um, but yeah, so in your own playthrough, go ahead and talk to her and you'll get one of those thingies. And as far as I know, I don't need to go into either of those houses um so we're just gonna head into the gym and let me think wow i have like <laughs> not a good pokemon for this for this gym but you know what that's okay that is okay um we're going to just go ahead and say whatever and start finding some pokemons and there's, uh, this gym is got a little bit of puzzle to it. Uh, when you, yeah, see, uh, you don't really know what hole to drop from or go up from. And some of them have, uh, trainers hidden in them. So I'm just going to go up to random ones and try stuff because I don't know where I'm going. And... Actually, I think I do know where I'm going, but we're just gonna we're gonna wing it. Just gonna wing it, cause that's that's how I like to do things. I like to just wing it, and I I I can't go anywhere. So we're gonna go back this way, and we're gonna go up here and use that one instead, and run down this way. And hey, it looks like we got us a trainer battle. All right, all right. Let's go with some water gun. Goodbye. Uh, Marshamp, good pick. Good pick, Marsh Tom. Uh, you got anybody? You got anybody? Yes, you do. And Slugma, use my Marshy Tompy. I'll probably be using Marsh Tom throughout this entire gym. Uh, just because it's like the only Pokemon I have that has super effective moves. Uh, so yeah, that that's that's my reasoning. And we're gonna... Oh, whoops. I don't think that's what I wanted to do. But we're gonna check out this place. Oh, we got a double battle. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Alright, so. Use some water gun on you and some. Ooh. Well, okay. Well, whatever. I use magnitude. It'll probably hit my marsh taunt, but I guess it doesn't do that much damage. And it did very little damage to Kecleon as well. So, we're just going to switch back to, uh, to Ember there. And try and take it down. And we did. Which is awesome. 
And we're going to run over here. Got nobody, got nobody, got somebody. And we got a numb. All should be able to take down one hit. And uh, now we get to make the arbitrary choice of which hole to go down. I choose this one. And we got we got peoples to fight. We got you to fight. That means I will be falling down the other one once I get out of this battle. And I wanna I wanna try and get through this gym here. Uh, I don't wanna have to save the gym battle for the next episode, so I'm just gonna try and blast through this as quick as I can. And we got a medi tight and use detect. Gosh dang it. And you. Okay. You got anybody? We're gonna go down this one just for the hex of it. And gosh dang it, I don't know where to go. This one, this one, and no, start over. Uh oh, frick. <laughs> boop, boop, boop. Uh, this one. Uh, this one. Frick. Uh, this one. Uh, this one. Uh, this one. Uh, this one? Frick. Uh, frick. That's not what I want to do. Okay, I, I am getting so turned around. Anyways, this one, and I believe this one? Yes. Did I go that one, that one first? Crap, I forget. Okay. You. Frick, that's what I did before. Okay. Okay. Next time, how about you all just remind me which one I went down? Uh, okay. Go to this one, and we go to this one, and we go to this one. Frick. Uh, and dang it, one, neither of them have. Dang it. Wait, where are you? Yay, I win. I win. Okay, so we got Marsh Top, and he's taking a little bit of damage, so we're just going to go ahead and use a few of our potions that we've acquired because I don't want to go back to the Pokemon Center. And hopefully we have enough uh, water guns. We're going to check our summary here real quick. And we got 11 of them. Should be fine because we also got ground type moves which are also effective. And we have Numble which also has uh, uh, ground type moves. But uh, Puny Trainer, how good uh, to see you've made it here. Uh, I have been entrusted with... Uh, oh wait, I am Flannery. I am the gym leader here. Uh, dare not underestimate me, though. Uh, I have been leader only a short time. Uh, with skills inherited from my grandfather, I shall, uh, demonstrate, uh, the hot moves of, uh, we have honed on this land. Uh, so we got Flannery here, and she has only been the gym leader for a short while, but, uh, I assure you, she is a tough one, especially with her, uh, Torkoal. Torkoal can be, uh, pretty scary sometimes, depending on which Pokemon you're using. Uh, but I think I'm going to be okay, uh, just because, you know, I I have Marchchomp here, and he's probably going to sweep this place. But, you know, what happened last time I said I was going to sweep a place. <laughs> but anyways, ooh, Hyper Potion. And upped its uh, special defense, so I'm going to use a physical type attack instead. We got Camera Upt. And I want to use Water Gun, but I don't feel like it's going to do a lot of damage, and it didn't. Well, that's okay. I should be able to take it down in one more hit unless it uses a Hyper Potion, of course. And, ooh. And goodbye. Uh, so for me, this was actually a fairly easy battle. And she didn't have a Torkoal. Wait, wait a second. Doesn't she have a Torkoal? That's like, that's, okay, there it is. I thought the battle was over there for a second. My bad, my bad, everybody. Uh, Torkoal. Torkoal, blah, 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 blah. Torkoal can be kind of nasty because it does that to you. Uh, and then it does that to you. And... Oh, and I still used it. Nice. Oh, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Uh, let's go, Nomo. Hopefully, uh... Frick, I pressed the wrong button. I suck. Gah! Alright, everybody, I'm a terrible... I'm a terror, but we're going to use Match Punch because I think that'll not take it down. What the heck? Oh my gosh, this is going to turn out really bad, everybody. I'm. Oh my gosh. Use Headbutt. Oh, phew. I am. I'm just not doing so hot. 
I think part of the problem is I, I've been playing like right after work and I'm just like exhausted. But whatever. Uh, I have to do this uh, thing the my na natural way. If I don't, my Pokemon will be confused. And my alarm is going off because... Uh, uh, because uh, it's been 20 minutes. But anyways, uh, thanks for teaching me that. For that, you deserve this. Uh, I got some money! And uh, we also get uh, a badge, uh, which means that Pokemon up to level 50 will obey us. And now we can use strength outside of battle. And we get TM50, which is overheat, which is that crazy move that Torkoal was using. Uh, but I also sharply cast the special attack that the blah 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 soon for long battles. Uh, so, overheat... Uh, is a move that when used it lowers the special attack after it's used so when you use it consecutively it it's kind of not good but anyways we got a uh, May here what's up May framed long time no see oh while I visited the hot springs uh, you got the lava ridge gym badge you must have collected good Pokemon no I believe you raised some I guess it would be okay for you to have this I got the go go goggles uh, put them in my bag. With the Gilgo goggles, you have no trouble getting through the desert near Route 11, 111. But, wow, framed, challenging gyms. Uh, you're trying hard because you don't want to lose to me, I bet. Framed, I think I should challenge your dad to Impedal and blah, 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 challenge your dad in Pedalberg Gym. Uh, see you again. Uh, so that was just kind of a little hint hint that uh, the next gym battle is in Pedalberg. Uh, city, town, or whatever, uh, which is uh, our father's gym, I guess. The first time I played this, I was so lost because I did not know where to go uh, because I couldn't use surf yet and I didn't have surf, and uh, I just I just didn't know where to go and I didn't realize that I had to go fight my father in Petersburg gym. But yeah, uh, yeah, that is uh, that'll be our next stop. And I think I'm gonna end the episode right here. I will make my way to back to Petersburg. Uh, Petersburg town, city, whatever, uh, in the next episode. Uh, but yeah, until then, I hope you... Oh, wait. I also have to say, uh, if you like this video, leave a like. And uh, <laughs> if you have anything to say, go ahead and leave that in the comment section. Uh, if you have, uh, you know, any other little challenges that you want to uh, have me do. Uh, like this thing I will probably be doing with my Magikarp that I'll obtain at some point. Uh, go ahead and leave that in the comment section, and if you have anything else to say, go ahead and leave, ahead and leave that in the comment section. Excuse me. Uh, if you like what I'm doing here and you want to stay up to date with what I'm doing, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And uh, until next time, hope you have a wonderful day, and I'll catch you all next time.